you're going to say again, why didn't I just buy a set? <laughs> well, try going down the Fiat dealership and say you want some, some of these little um, link bushes for your 1975 Fiat 130 coupe. You know, I don't think they'll be talking to you for long, will they? Probably call the cops. So we've got another in. On our lovely Fiat 130 coupe, we've got the gearbox out. I say ours, it's not mine at all, it's customers. But it's, it's a beautiful car, one of the nicest ones I've ever seen, and I'm a big fan of 130 coupes, which if you watched my Paolo Pinafrina video, you'll see my 130 coupe in that, or my old 130 coupe. So the gearbox is out of that one, and that's off with uh, our, our friends Stanton Transmissions in Tunbridge, who are rebuilding that. Um, it actually operates all right, it's just got numerous oil leaks. But anyway, they're doing that, they're sorting that out. And whilst we're doing that, I've got the control linkage out of it. And what I found was it's missing its bushes. So these bushes here were missing. They were missing. So, and you're not much use without them, is it, really? A lot of slack in it. So what we'd had was one end, someone had wedged this in there, a couple of old wiring grommets. One end had that in there. Sort of they'd jerry-rigged that in there and it was all sort of falling apart. And then the other end had nothing in it. Which we'll have a quick look on the car and see what, see what that actually was like in practice. So that meant we've got to make some of them. So we've got a bit of stock. And if you watch the film, you can see me make them. So you're going to say again, why didn't I just buy a set? <laughs> well, try going down the Fiat dealership and say you want some, some of these little um, link bushes for your 1975 Fiat 130 coupe. You know, I don't think they'll be talking to you for long, will they? Probably call the cops. So we've got a nutter in. Anyway, you can watch me make them. So enjoy that. Right, this time we're using this big drill. So we're just parting off in the Super 7.
That's better, isn't it? See, what happens is the originals are made of this sort of nylon-y stuff and they just sort of fall apart and disappear. And just end up on the road. But that won't fall apart, will it? That'll be good. You've got a little bit of play in it, which is what you need, otherwise it'll be too much, won't it? You don't want it too rigid. But obviously we don't want it <laughs> as slack as it was before. Turned out nice again. George Formby, why don't you say that? There we are. Good night. <laughs>